what's going on YouTube uh, in this video we're gonna be going over the alpha bridge set and what has changed um, if you guys haven't seen my last video make sure you go back and check that uh, that's the changes to the Banshee gear set so th the most notable differences from what people are used to in 1.5 is that you only share the free talent now instead of getting all six you have four the free talent is uh, the talent that you need to that you don't need any uh, specs for like in this case it's destructive okay there is some things that are a little bit different when you go into the description of the four piece set all talent requirements are ignored for all weapon talents and this I think is wrong um, and for Alpha Bridge fans, they're going to love this. But if they're looking for balance, this is what I think will still make Alpha Bridge one of the metas. ARs are already going to be a meta. The uh, SMGs are way too weak. And 1.6. 1.6, I don't think, besides a couple videos I made with the Valkyrie, before they nerfed that, that is the only SMG people were using. Now everybody's using ARs. Everybody's using... Um, in 1.5 the FAMAS now it's the bullfrog or the or the lightweight M4 but there's a change there too and I'll, I'll, I'll point that out as well but so all talent requirements are ignored that's this number right here so right now I'm pretty balanced on what I got going on besides electronics but so you need like 3800 to um, pretty much unlock any of the firearm talents but you could drop this all the way down to 2,000. You could have nothing stacked at all towards firearms. Put everything into your toughness or skill power. So you can be running Alpha Bridge with pretty much a Seeker Mind build. With 200,000 plus skill power. Or four or 500,000 toughness. And still have all your talents. So... Focus 3800 commanding. This is these are these are garbage rolls, but I'm just kind of throwing it out here and uncomplicated and destructive. None of these none of these numbers right here matter with the new Alpha Bridge set. Not all. As long as you have four priests Alpha Bridge on, every single one of these talents are going to be available to you. Doesn't matter what this number is at all. So if we switch to the lightweight M4 and put the bullfrog as a secondary, you don't get any talents here, okay? So I'll just have my deadly, unforgiving, destructive. I won't have that fourth talent because this is an exotic weapon. So no exotic weapon can be in the secondary slot to give your lightweight M4 or police M4 or whatever high-end weapon you're using. And you can't use two exotics there you see what I'm saying so if I switch the the bullfrog back to primary I'll have that fourth talent and destructive and this is the free talent for for the bullfrog which the FAMAS in 1.5 is uncomplicated and this is what why everybody used it the increased damage here so I guess that's one big change that is actually a good change I guess but I was under the assumption that the bullfrog was pretty much not going to be able to be used for Alpha Bridge anymore, which I don't really care if it is or isn't, to be honest. Um, I think more of an issue is not having any talent requirements. I think that is an issue. I think that definitely needs to be balanced. Um, I think that's going to cost everybody to use ARs if they're, you know what I mean? It, it doesn't really, they take one thing away, they take two talents away. But then they make it so you can run a fucking Seeker Mind build with an Alpha Bridge set with all your talents unlocked. And maybe that's what they're looking for. But in 1.6, Seeker Minds are absolutely crazy. The stagger is unbelievable. So if we switch... Let's go Lightweight M4 and the ACR. Lightweight M4 is my primary. I'll have that fourth talent because these are both high ends. See what I'm saying? Now, if we went back 
and put uh, let's see here okay so we can now we got two exotics you're not gonna get that fourth talent so you can run two high ends together and get the fourth talent you can run an exotic as your primary and a high end as your secondary and get that fourth talent but it can't be the other way around make sense I definitely think there's gonna be some balancing issues and I mean I guess that's why that's what PTS is for maybe maybe I'm just looking into it too much but let me know what you guys think do you guys think that's that's a little crazy that you don't have to worry about your worry about any any of your talents I don't know. I think that I think that needs to be balanced a little bit. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. These are the changes to the Alpha Bridge set. Any more notable changes that come to the gear sets, I'll be sure to make a video on. Um, as far as Banshee and Alpha Bridge, I guess that is the biggest so far. Um, probably my next build is either going to be. I I don't know. I'm sure you guys want to see a Seeker build, so maybe I'll make a maybe I'll make a Seeker build and. If not, I'll probably show either show off new dark zones, new dark zone bosses, uh, maybe some contamination fields, something like that, something different. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like button, sub if you haven't, and I'll see you guys on my next one.